So next week we get ready to fall back. Daylight savings time ends at 2 a.m. Sunday, November 4th. That is just next weekend. And our first guest this morning is here to help us keep safe during those longer nights ahead. Welcome Andy Amrine of EV True Value Hardware. Andy, great to be with you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy being here today. <laughs> and uh, you know, it is dark sooner, staying dark Daylight longer. Up. We right. got trick or treaters we next week and sure. all that. So we're trying to keep everything nice and bright outside and Very safety good. wise. And there's some really fun new things out there for it in the way of uh, security lights. Okay. Uh, What'd the, you bring? The first one is this unit called a ring. And this one, this is you can replace your front porch light or you can replace a floodlight on the house. But this does everything because it has a motion sensor. It has a camera built into it so very simple two wires but now everything can be operated by your phone so you can see who's coming nice. up next to your house mm -hmm. you can it's a two-way talk you can turn on a oh, siren boy. you can flash the lights you can do whatever you want in the way of a security system all in one box all in just hooking up two wires and running it through an app on your phone itself wow. a pretty new high-tech type of security light Very so good. it's not just a light bulb outside anymore that does it, quite it a bit. does everything mm -hmm. on it Very or good. if you have an area in the house that you want a light but there's no electricity there and you don't want to hire an electrician or someone to run new lights you can now get outdoor solar powered ones so oh, this okay. light has a solar panel on it. It has a floodlight and a motion sensor, so you can pretty much stick it anywhere, even if you want it on the side of a shed, your garage, a wall, whatever, and you don't have to worry about running the power to it itself. Very so good. It's, it's really all self-contained, LED of course, and it's right there. Great. Also, you can just get a little sidewalk light. Um, this is a solar powered stake light. You can just stick it in the ground or if you have some of that um, Halloween decorations that you want to light up and sure. you don't want to run extension cords or something. It's just a, once again, an LED um, solar power type of safety light. And then you get into your traditional type of uh, floodlight units mm -hmm. that run all on your electricity. Um, so mounting it to the walls and so forth, you can can get uh, motion sensor ones or regular ones or a nice little compact one. This is a battery oh, powered. Is nice. This is oh, runs wow. on a battery, couple A, ba couple double A mm -hmm. batteries. It has a mounting bracket and then just has a switch on it. So you could turn it on when you need the extra light, turn it off when you don't. Sure. Once again, be an LED. So you're, it's all compact and ready to go with it. And then, um, you know, your typical just light bulbs. A lot of people okay. have your outside floodlights, right. but they don't work because the bulbs are out. Mm. And with your traditional type of light bulbs, they only are good for a year or two. Mm -hmm. Why not upgrade to an LED flood light bulb? And this bulb's good for 20 years. Sure. You know, so if you're going to wow. climb that ladder to change the bulb, you might as well change the bulb once the once it's only going to yes, do Andy. right. Yep. You know, or, you know, once again, in your lamp post or your uh -huh. front lights, if you're changing them, make sure you're using the LED type bulbs, whether it's a small candelabra base mm -hmm. or regular base ones, you're using the LED, they use next to nothing in power and they're going to last a lot longer than regular type light bulbs. That's and then great. these are two really interesting new type of LED bulbs. Th us. This one is a motion sensing light bulb. So wow. instead of changing the whole fixture, you just put this light bulb in your front porch light uh -huh. or your post light and you can set a switch on it where it'll come on day or night or you can set it to just come on at night and if someone walks by the bulb, it turns on. Wow. And it'll stay on for a short period of time, uh -huh. you know, like five minutes or so, and then it'll turn itself back off again. So it's a motion safety security type light um, that you just leave it on and away you go. Oh, that's fantastic. Or same that's got to be popular, I bet. It is. That's and then really it's popular. the same type device, an LED bulb, but this one has a dusted on photo eye on it. Which is so that? meaning that you put this in and at night it turns on and it stays on all night and then when the sun comes up it turns itself off again mm -hmm. so if you want that light on all night mm -hmm. instead of just when somebody walks by it this will turn itself on stay on all night because it works on daylight and nighttime sure. so it's a dusted on on it and you know, or if you want to just change and use regular bulbs you can get a dusted on adapter to put it into your light fixture and it has the sensing uh, photo cell on it, it'll do the same thing. Come on at night, stay on, and then uh, daytime, it turns itself back off again. Mm -hmm. And then just some fun things for trick-or-treaters. Right. Um, yeah. We have a snap light. 
And you should just snap them, uh -huh. and now you have a glow Ooh, stick for all the trick or treaters, and Aww. that'll that'll stay lit for 12 hours. Okay. Um, or there's just little flasher strobe light buttons where you can put it oh, on safety buttons. a That's safety great. button and you can just mm -hmm. put it on the little trick-or-treaters and you know keep them safe as they're out there or if you're walking around with your pet you have a dog collar and Wonderful. it uh, is LED and mm -hmm. it'll either flash or just stay on completely with mm -hmm. it and then for the adults you have a, a headlight this is one that has the strap you wear it on your head and your has the light on it you know, mm -hmm. that way your hands free or sure. of course every trick-or-treater needs some kind of an LED flashlight well, nice flash and it's a light. nice little Look compact that one is. that'll uh, you know, fit in your glove compartment you your purse your key right. ring or anything like that That's and great. if all else fails what do we have at the end of the table? Some candles. candles. So there you go. Or if you're oh, the, I was looking for something special. <laughs> no, no, you those have all are these real. Fancy those are just real here, live thinking, candles. Okay. They still do okay. make candles. Or if you're putting them in your <laughs> Halloween pumpkin or anything, there, there's what you need for your pumpkins. Good to do. So have your candles. You I didn't bring a match, so these. you still need a match. <laughs> we'll do. Okay. Well, Andy Amron, thank you so much My for pleasure. being here. Andy's, of course, from EV True Value Hardware. He's also a regular PTL contributor. Glad to have him with us today.